Hi. With MRP Easy Professional Edition, it is possible to track serial numbers of your parts and products. This functionality allows tracking each physical item individually by a serial number, seeing status and history of actions with each serial numbered item, saving which parts were used in a specific product by serial numbers. To enable serial number tracking for an item, open its details page in the stock section and check the serial numbers checkbox. Serial numbers must be tracked for this item. The serial numbers report becomes available for this item. Overview of your serial numbers. In the stock serial numbers section, you will see the overview of all serial numbers recorded in the system. Here, it's possible to search for a specific serial number and see its status and full history. Custom fields for serial numbers. In addition, it's possible to freely add custom fields for the serial numbers, which will be displayed in the serial numbers table. These can be found at Settings, System Settings, Custom Fields section. This allows storing specific information which you need to know about each item. Saving Serial Numbers for Parts To record serial numbers during receipt, click on the Target lot in the Purchase Order, which will take you to the Stock Lot's details. In the Serial Numbers section, enter the serial numbers. You can either type in the serial numbers, copy them from a spreadsheet and paste in bulk, or scan them with a barcode reader. Save and click back to repeat the process with other items on the purchase order. Alternatively, it's always possible to open the stock lot via the Stock Stock Lots section and fill in the serial numbers. Saving serial numbers for products and tracking parts used in manufacturing. The serial numbers of products can be defined in the manufacturing order. Depending on whose responsibility it is, these could be predefined by the manager or planner or entered by the workers. The manager can use the administrative screen on the manufacturing order and click Add a Serial Number to Product button. By default, MRP Easy Auto fills the serial number by incrementing it. Alternatively, you can either type in the serial numbers, copy them from a spreadsheet and paste in bulk, or scan them with a barcode reader. If there are parts that must have serial numbers saved, then for each product's serial number, you must save that part's serial number. Only these parts' serial numbers, which are available from booked stock lots for this manufacturing order, can be chosen from. If there was any entry mistake, it's always possible to come back and edit the serial number's details. For entering product serial numbers, it's also possible to just open the stock lot of the products by clicking on the target lot to predefine them. For the worker, reporting via the My Production Plan functionality is identical and works the same. They can use the Add a Serial Number to Product button scan the serial numbers, and save part serial numbers. For the worker reporting serial numbers via the Internet Kiosk, the Advanced Mode of Internet Kiosk must be enabled at Settings, System Settings, Software Settings to access serial numbers. To report serial numbers, Click on the Serial Numbers button, enter the product serial number, 
and select part serial numbers. When you are finished with a product, click Save. Once saved, in the Internet Kiosk mode, it is not possible to edit already saved serial numbers details. Shipping Serial Numbered Items At first, when the shipment is planned, then the items are only booked based on the stock lot number, which allows you to plan a shipment even before products with specific serial numbers have been manufactured. When items are being picked for a shipment, then the software asks which serial numbers are being picked. Select the Shipped Serial Numbers and Save. Now it's possible to see which serial numbers a customer received and which specific parts were used in it when they were purchased and so on. Customer Returns When using the Enterprise function Return Merchandise Authorization, it's possible to record which serial numbered products were returned to you. Then, MRP Easy will add the customer return and service information to the serial numbers history. To record the serial number, simply click the plus button in the RMA order to save the serial number of the product and MRP Easy will match it with the serial number already saved in the system. The serial number tracking can be enabled in the section Settings, System Settings, Professional Functions. In this video, we described how the serial number tracking system works. To learn more about MRP Easy, please see our other videos. Thanks for watching.